and I just called him over and I didn't say test or anything and he just sniffed my breath and put the paw up. You were in the road! <laughs> just don't forget to laugh every day. <laughs> Good morning guys. Mary's blood sugar's low, so we're gonna have Ollie test. He already alerted me, so he's yeah. like, why are you... Asking me to do yeah. it again. So yeah, it's a, it's a smell of my breath when your blood sugar drops. And so his, what Amanda trained him to do when her blood sugar is low is to put his paw on her legs. So, <clears throat> his... Oh, like, blood sugar alert is not his primary task. But he was trained for it because my blood sugars do drop randomly. But because it's been random, and sometimes like it won't drop for a week. But with it being more consistent, um, he's able to pick up on it easier as it becomes more consistent. Yeah, it's just it's been so infrequent, like up till now, uh, that it hasn't been a regular task of his. So. This week he's been alerting her from time to time when her blood sugar does drop. So I can either say test, and then he sn sniffs my breath, um, or earlier, um, I had already tested my blood sugar, so I knew that I was low, um, and so I just called him over, because we're getting ready to leave, and I just called him over and I didn't say test or anything, and he just sniffed my breath and put the paw up. He knew. Um, so, anyway. So, her blood sugar was 65. So, Ollie, I need to drink something. Yeah, Ollie's trained to <coughs> alert at 70. And so, anyways, that's, we just wanted to show you guys that. And we're getting ready to go kayaking. Woo! And oh, I wanted to add, part of why we were, um, why I'm being more consistent with making a point of like having him come over and test while I am low is the hope is with time <clears throat> he will be sensing it before I do and then he will alert me when I'm 70 before I'm feeling shaky so I can treat but with the inconsistency it's hard for him to pick up on that task and again, like I said before, this isn't his main task. His main task is mobility. So if he were to, even if in training he didn't pick this up, you know, back when Amanda had him, if this wasn't something that he picked up, that's totally fine. This is not his main task. But since we have the opportunity that my blood sugar is dropping a lot, we might as well make a point of um, helping him learn this yeah. more consistently. Practicing, Practicing yeah. And one aspect of this is we don't know if like this blood sugar dropping is seeming to continue somewhat at, at, since Mary's stopped the drug the child drug that she's on so if this is for some reason her body like as she's getting older having more blood sugar issues this will be a very helpful task for Oliver to be able to do yeah <laughs> And if it turns out that this is just my body and this is going to be more consistent issue, I will talk with a nutritionist and figure out what to set my body up for success. Um, even though I haven't changed my diet in the last few weeks, but my blood sugars have changed, um, maybe I need to change my diet. So maybe I need to... It's, it's going to be... <laughs> It's gonna be mind over matter. In, I'm having trouble talking. I need to. Yeah, let's get you some <laughs> Um. Okay. So basically, what I'm saying is, if I need to like force myself to eat like some nuts every two hours, or what it is that I need to do to my diet to set my body up for success with the whole blood sugar issue. So we will see in the next few days how this goes. If my blood sugars 
drop when I'm off of the study drug, that probably just means it's my body. Um, but we'll see what happens. All right, we'll see you later. Okay guys, we are getting ready to leave and you are going in the Ziploc to be protected from the water. All right, Peter's taking the boat, the kayak in, and we are just waiting. And then we will go in with him. This is fun. So nice. Oh yeah, see that duck goose thing? They can go under the water for like 20 seconds or something. Oh, there it goes, there it goes. Did you see it go under? Now we'll see how long it takes till it comes back up. What are you doing? Remember those ducks that can go under the water? Oh yeah, is one under the water right now? Yep. Maybe that's it. Did it swim all the way? I don't know. But anyway, they're cool. Oh, there it went under again. Now let's see how far it goes. There it goes, that's so cool. Hey guys, we are out on the water just enjoying this beautiful day. And um, you can see that I got a little chilly, I put a sweatshirt on and Peter took his shirt off. So. Because I'm doing all the work. <laughs> yeah. It's true. It's true. I, I was made for you. All of these lines across my face Tell you the story of who I am How's it going? Good. There are two swans up here that appear to be giant, but I don't think they are. I don't know why, but every time we go through these tunnels, I sing Just around the river bend I look once more Just around the river bend Beyond the shore And then when we get to the end of it I sing I can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Tell me, princess, now when did you last let your heart decide that these swans are giant? <laughs> they are giant. I think Ollie smells something delicious in the air. <coughs> it was really windy back there, but it feels calmer here, right? Yeah. Just around the river bend, I look once more. Just around the river bend, beyond the shore. That is all I know of that song. <laughs> Just around the river bend, to see once more. I don't know, I might have made that part up. I can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Mary's turn to to paddle. It is a workout. It is a workout. Especially good, when you good. have decreased lung function. <laughs> good job. Yeah. This can be your elliptical for the day. I don't know about that. Hey, you just splashed me. Don't hurt me. <laughs> Mary is covered up in a blanket to protect her from the sun, and Oliver has climbed up into her lap. Like. 
fully on my lap. I don't know. I can't see what you guys can see, but it's pretty cute. He's awesome. He is pretty great. We're going to start heading back. Our car is way over there. So we're going to start heading back, and when we get back, I guess we'll make some dinner. Mm -hmm. Aww. We're really thankful Ollie has... He's such a like flexible dog. He just like climbs into the kayak and adapts. <laughs> but it's really peaceful out here. We just like have been sitting out here just floating for a while, just relaxing and enjoying the sun, talking about life and you guys and all things the fry life. So we'll see you guys later. Guys, we are home and we've got dinner cooking. Mary's making some gravy, some corn cakes. We're about to sizzle, sizzle, fry, fry some pork. We made some mashed potatoes. And we're gonna have a delicious dinner. This yeah. is just like all the stuff that we had in the fridge and freezer. and mm -hmm. So we're like, let's make it. My, um, my blood sugar dropped again. And so I'm guessing we can almost say that it was not the study drug? Yeah, almost. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. the next couple days go. Yeah. So, anyways, we're gonna finish this up. We'll show you when we're done. All right, ready for dinner. And I guess we'll eat veggies, too, at some point. There's my corn cakes. There's the rest of the meat. And I've got two more corn cakes coming up. Okay. Let's eat. Let's eat. But first... You know how sometimes we find really awesome stuff on free Craigslist? Well, I'm looking through and look what I found. A free green alien fetus. Woohoo! Yeah! Let's go get it. Should we go get it? We should. Okay, let's go. Okay. We did not go get it. We were kidding. Just kidding. But we're not kidding. That is actually on Craigslist. Yeah. <laughs> it's really there. But we are working on orders. Right. I just wanted to show you guys this pack of cards I'm packing up and sending to Trish. I just, I've never seen somebody order these three together. So I thought, what a, what a good choice. But I can't <laughs> say that. What a good card pack. It is a cool card pack. It's very colorful, yeah. as Peter was saying. And I agree, it is very colorful. Good choices, Trish. But again, I feel awkward saying that because I'm the one who painted them. But she's the one who made the choice, so good job. This explains how all three of us are feeling. <laughs> we are finishing up for the night. It's been a long day. It's been a fun day. It's but... been a really fun day, but we are so tired. We're just packing up some finishing up. orders for the night and gonna get to bed. So we should say good night. So if you guys enjoyed coming on this adventure with us, please do give us a thumbs up. And, and as, as always, always we, we will see, see you, you tomorrow. tomorrow. Good, Good night. night. Hey, Ollie, you want to do a Q&A for the people? All right. First question is... <laughs>